and then what do I do with the oil? I have no idea what I do with the oil. <laughs> uh, what do you do? What do you actually do with the oil? So can I build the other? I can build the other mine. And I can upgrade this. Let's modernize this to a modern mine, so we can get more uranium. All right, good. Increases the amount in the deposit. Construction guys building right now. They did finish, uh, but they're building this. Okay, cannery. Right, 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 right. I need more workers. I need a lot more workers. Fresh fruit directly off the trees and bushes growing on our virgin island. Tired of the smell of freshly caught fish being cooked in a meat side barbecue. I know I'm not, but if you are. Our beloved government has built a factory that stuffs those in tin cans and fills them with preservatives just for you. Alright, can more stuff. Nice to meet you. I am Dr. Zweistein. I heard your nuclear situation may lead to a world war. So I felt obliged to come and assist you in the matter with my vast intelligence. All right, cool. I started researching a device which will resolve all your and the world's nuclear troubles and avoid such problems as total nuclear war. It will be either related to elementary particles reactions or time-space continuum on quantum level. Anyway, it is too complicated for you to understand. I will let you know when I have the, res the result. In the meantime, please go ahead with the actions to resolve the situation yourself. All right, Swistein's here. Presidente, if I have learned anything in the many years by your side, it is that no one wants to clean up your mess. Make a crisis ugly enough that no one will dare touch us because no one will want to deal with it. What do we need for a humanitarian crisis? Shacks. The more shacks, the worse. We can invite hundreds of homeless refugees, and their shacks will be the best defense against any attack. This is pure tropical wisdom. Effect 263 refugee re immigrants will come to tropical. Effect delay the invasion by 12 months. I actually need more workers. <laughs> Presidente, if I have learned anything in the many years by your side, I actually need more workers, so let's do that. I can always build houses. That's what all this space is for. I need a lot more money for the houses, though. <laughs> All right, we need eight hundred more rum. Uranium is complete. The nuclear program is. We have. 83 months left. All right, cool. The Politburo has proclaimed eternal friendship between the USSR and Tropico. The bad news is I got kissed by at least two Russians. All right, I'm going to trick myself into a stupid to forget this dreadful experience. It's up to you to tell our Soviet friends what you want from them. College educated workers. I just just take the money. I mean, I have a college. Right, so it's gonna be producing college workers for me. We've yeah. discovered the mineral oil, which cool. can be processed into gasoline. The cars in Tropical no longer need to run on magic. A profit. All right, great. Our very own Tropic and Gabriel 
office fun, fashion, dance, glee, and scantily clad women galore. It is like a small-scale Jolly Roger for city folk. Immigration. Uh... That number has not exploded yet. Should I be... I mean, should that, should that go up? Dramatically? Also, how many construction offices do I actually have? I have one there. Do I only have one? Job quality is 65. Wonder if I should put a put a manager there. Alright, we're building the economy hotel. I'm pretty sure I only have one construction office. Presidente. Have you ever thought about who your dearest friend is? The one who owes you most money. You don't really want anything bad to happen to them, right? Alright, now you get my idea with the invasion and the sovereign debt. Do not give me that look, Presidente. Of course, you're my dearest friend. Reach junk credit rating. Delay the invasion by 12 months. Oh boy, that's uh... Curious. Can I just like... Borrow a whole bunch of money and then s return it immediately. Sovereign debt. Issue bond, issue bond, issue bond. Alright, that's complete. And then buy bond, buy bond, buy bond. Oh, there's my, uh, Hundreds of people arriving on the island. Great. Since I have so many people now, let's go ahead and construction office. Quick build that. And uh, up the budget there. Where did all those people go? Are we supposed to get a whole lot of shacks? The nuclear program is now 102 months away. I just realized I should probably like straighten this road or something. Can I do that? Let me like pause that. Demolish. And then road. Uh, I think that's a bit better. So how many shacks did I... There's a, there's a few shacks. Not that bad. The Politburo has approved our fluid diplomatic techniques and is willing to send some diplomats our way. Alright, now we should build an embassy to house them. I suggest somewhere near a pub, old chap. Invite the USSR in an embassy. Plus 10 USSR relations. Hold on. Can we have the Politburo has proclaimed eternal friendship between the USSR. All right, great. Can we can we invite both? Can we like build two embassies and invite invite both sides? Presidente, in times as dark and dire as these, we must turn to our most powerful friends. 
Our most powerful friend is the U.S. president. He can drink a whole keg of beer and still lift an ox. Right, besides he is the commander-in-chief of the U.S. forces, right? His words should count whether they invade us or not. <laughs> I have found his personal phone number. It's 1-800-PRESIDENTS. Give him a call. If you reach him, he might help you. Call 1-800-PRESIDENT to talk to the U.S. president. Sure. Is this stuff being built? Not that one, not that one. Alright, get some tourists in there, not that they'll change much. In terms of our gameplay right now. Howdy, President, hey? I was wondering whether you were about to call me or defeat the US Army all by yourself. This invasion story is deeper than you think. There are some US generals which apparently want to start World War 3. I cannot cancel the invasion by myself, but by god I'll give you a head start. I'll make mandatory Spanish classes for every US soldier to participate in the mission. This will slow things down a bit. The US president will delay the invasion by 12 months. Thank you. Thank you very much. I should build some houses. Well, more than that, I should build uh, more oil wells. Wasn't there another deposit? There is another one out here. It's kind of far away from everything. So how many people are unemployed right now? Workforce unemployed 190... 179. I can massively expand... Oh yeah, employment. I can massively expand my uh, production stuff. Furniture factory... Um... Do I, do I have a steel mill? I have a steel mill. I have a steel mill, furniture factory... I don't have uh, gold mines yet. Um... Circus. That doesn't quite fit. Cabaret, casino. Did I have a casino? Cabaret. Don't seem to have a casino. That requires power. Right there is fine. And then another circus. So I want family tourists. Like that. Distillery, sugar input, rum output. So, like, are these running f at full capacity? Textile mill, cannery. This is a uh, natural gas and oil. I'm gonna switch this over to natural gas. Gas turbines. Pollution filter. Mm -hmm. 
Our relations with the Great Soviet Union are now in the eternal friendship phase. This means we are eternally friend-zoned. Alright, we need to be more active if we want the USSR to love us. Send the delegation to the USSR from the embassy. Plus 10 USSR relations. Sure, delegation... Did it have to be the USSR, old chap? Couldn't we have sent a delegation to somewhere warmer? Alright, anyway, as a good professional, I adapted and thorough think drinking copious amounts of alcohol managed to survive the harsh Russian conditions. I also wrote the demands on my hands so as not to forget them when I get drunk. Here they are. I have two hospitals. I can use some hospitals anyway. Uh, hospital. Which I'm encroaching on the, uh... On the, um... Lumber. What's it called? Logging camp. I'm encroaching on the logging camp over there. Which I should avoid. I can just move the logging camp. That's not a big deal. Our relations with the Great Soviet Union. These things are still not building. This is being built, okay. We tried to discover democracy, but it proved ex Uh Plutocracy Open Society High Liberty Assassinate of Banish Limited Special Citizens Harder to Discover. I think I want open society there. Subsidized media. Let's watch the uh watch my budget. Don't get too crazy. Petrochemicals. Pollution generated is halved, but consumes much more electricity. Adds an additional production cycle to oil refinery processes coal into oil. That's interesting. Produces natural gas based on the number of plantations and hydroponic farms in the area. That's interesting. I should just spam more plantations. Maybe I should like spam corn plantations and then I'll switch my uh, my ranches into factory farms. 